Batman fans, Jet from GC Kids here with another Batman 101 episode. Today, we're looking at what makes the Cape Crusader such a special hero. No, it's not the Batmobile, it's his commitment to justice. Batman doesn't just have an arsenal of cool gadgets, he has a strong moral code at his very core, which means he always tries to do the right thing and protect the innocent. We could have rid Gotham of the fools in City Hall and the police department. We could have made our own order! I was born to fight your brand of order. Sometimes, that means having to make big sacrifices for the greater good. But sometimes, that just means helping out someone in need. Like in this moment from Justice League, where he proves you don't always need a special suit to be a good friend. Bonsoir, Wonder Woman. Bonsoir, Monsieur. It's Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman? Look, it's Wonder Woman. <laughs> what is it like working with Superman? When you fought the aliens, were you scared? Um... Are you really from an island with no men? I... May I have this dance? Yes. Thank you, Mr... Wayne. Bruce Wayne. I appreciate the rescue. I'm surprised to see you here. From what I've heard, this isn't really your sort of affair. I've decided to get out more, have a little fun. Enjoying yourself so far? More than I expected. How about you? What brings you to the City of Lights? I never miss a good party. Wow, Batman can be such a gentleman, not to mention an amazing dancer. He's as honorable as he is strong, and you could be like him too. It's our only choice. His anger comes from feeling he's an outcast. We have to remind him he's not. Imagine that you're Batman. Yes, you. Pretty cool, right? You've got a Batcave and Alfred and all those awesome Bat gadgets. But you've also got great knowledge of what's right and wrong. Now, picture this. It's night in Gotham City, and the Bat signal just lit up the sky. The Joker's robbing the art museum. You hop in the Batmobile and rush to the scene of the crime. But on the way, you spot a thief running off with an old lady's purse. What should you do? Would you, A, Ignore it. You're only interested in the Joker. B. Stop the thief. The Joker can wait because that old lady needs your help. C. Come back later. Maybe you can comfort her and buy her a new purse. So, what would Batman do? Maybe this scene from Batman the Animated Series will help us out. Batman's got to make a super hard decision in the heat of the moment. So, pay close attention and see what he does. Freeze! That's Mr. Freeze to you. This is a personal vendetta. It doesn't concern you. Easy, man. I got you. Leave him. He should have been more careful. Now he's paid the price for his incompetence. But he's one of us. Then perhaps you'd like to share his fate. <laughs> Don't leave me, please.
I must say, you're showing a surprising amount of compassion for that man, considering he would surely have left you to die in his place. With all the compartments on your belt, you'd think there'd be one for tissues. Thanks. He's pulling through. The hot chemical bath did the trick. You could use a hot bath yourself. See how Batman saved the henchmen instead of going after Mr. Freeze? It was a hard decision to make. But Batman knows that saving people always takes priority. Even if that person's a criminal. My hero. So if you were Batman, what would you do about the thief and the purse? Well, you should... Fee, stop the thief. The Joker can wait because that old lady needs your help. The Joker might be Batman's greatest adversary, but saving the day isn't just about putting the clown prince behind bars. It's about helping out whenever you need it. Monsters, come no closer. Don't worry, I'll protect you from these. Monsters. That's what I just said, monsters. You see, Batman is a true hero, with or without the suit. Being Batman means knowing the difference between right and wrong, and trying to do the right thing, even if that means saving an unlikely person. Listen to me, all the work you've done, your freedom. If you run away, you'll lose them, Harley. You're so close to winning back your real life. Why risk it now? I'm having a bad day. I'm sick of people trying to shoot me, run me over, and blow me up. I didn't even get to keep my new dress. Again, jiggity jig. Not for too long, though. Miss Vreeland dropped the kidnapping charges. With a little more hard work, you should be ready to re enter society for good. Yay. There's one thing I gotta know. Why'd you stay with me all day, risking your butt for someone who's never given you anything but trouble? I know what it's like to try and rebuild a life. I had a bad day, too, once. See, Batman would even save a supervillain like Harley Quinn because it's the right thing to do. That's what I'd call a true hero. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got to get going. There are plenty of innocent citizens that need my help. Jet to the rescue! Thanks for watching, everyone. And you can check out Cape Chris Saturdays every week for more Batman content here on the DC Kids channel. All animated episodes featured in this video are available for digital download with Warner Home Entertainment. Catch you later!